So let me ask her about another offender serving time right now. Not a rapist, but a dangerous criminal with a history of brutal violence. Tiffany Scott, formerly known as Andrew Burns, claims to be a woman. Does the First Minister believe this criminal is a woman? First Minister. I think Douglas Ross is demonstrating here a lack of understanding in the law. Uh, any rights, any rights uh, that any individual identifying as a woman uh, have uh, flow not from any decisions of this government or any decisions of this parliament. They flow uh, from the protected characteristic provisions in the 2004 Equality Act, which is UK-wide legislation and is and has always been based on self-identification. A gender recognition certificate, and of course the law passed by this Parliament is not yet in force, but a gender recognition certificate uh, simply enables somebody to change their birth certificate. It does not give trans people any additional rights, um, and that is important. Uh, and in terms of how individuals are treated uh, within the prison service, uh, as I have said, that is based on the nature of the crime and the nature of the risk posed. And both of the cases, of course, that Douglas Ross has cited today demonstrate that in terms uh, of the prisons uh, that these individuals are in. Um, and in terms of uh, how prisoners are treated when they leave prison, uh, for sex offenders, of course, there are well-established uh, procedures, including the MAPA procedures. And again, they are based on an assessment of the nature of risk. So these are important issues. Uh, they are sensitive issues, not least for uh, the trans community. As I said last week and I've said before, uh, the overwhelming majority of whom only want to go on with living their lives and never commit any offences of any nature. But I don't think Douglas Ross uh, does any service to anybody in the way that he approaches this. Uh, I'm struck uh, by something his predecessor, a Scottish uh, Conservative uh, leader, Ruth Davidson, uh, has said. Trying to do gotcha questions about who is a woman who is a man, I'm not sure helps, particularly for people in the trans community who are looking at the way this is reported. Uh, so perhaps Douglas Ross uh, could take some guidance from his predecessor uh, on uh, this matter, and that might uh, serve this whole debate better than the way he is doing right now. Okay.